My name is Margaret Ryan and I now live in Taronga. Um, most of my life I've been brought up in Auckland because of my stroke down in Taronga. Um, when I first got, when I first felt aphasia, then I, I didn't even know what it was. Didn't want how how I'm meant to feel or doing anything like that. But when I had aphasia the first time, that's when I discovered I couldn't walk, talk, or talk to anybody, and nobody could understand me. Oh, that's that's terrible. Um, because I can't speak to anybody and know that that. That, that the person I'm talking to understood me. Um, I spent the first five years of, of that stuff feeling all these, um, feeling all those things about me. Um, and I knew I couldn't do anything about it. Um, but then I, I started to believe that I could. I must be able to, to do anything that I could do before. But I couldn't write, I couldn't talk, <laughs> and I couldn't even see it. But um, before that, I was uh, I was uh, um, I was a singer. Um, uh, uh, I'm a recording artist. And I have my own business. Six years after I had a stroke, I met Robin and he, he took me along to the first place that they had. And that was the first time I heard the voices that people were going to sing. And they, they were, um, they were lost especially me. But after that, I went every week and every time I was there, I got better. I was learning then to communicate. What communication means to me, it must mean an awful lot, but um, communication to me is me being able to speak and make them understand what I'm trying to say.